Hi guys, in this video we're going to talk about how to reduce lung stress with a salt inhaler. I don't know if you've ever heard about this before. It's really a cool mechanism and you'd use it for asthma, bronchitis, allergies, sinus mucus, lung mucus, sinus mucus, hay fever, COPD, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, sleep apnea, sleep apnea, that's spelled wrong, and adrenal fatigue, okay? So it looks like this, and there's a lot of different ones you can get online. And what you do, it's like a neti pot. It is a neti pot. You open up the bottom, and you put Himalayan sea salt, okay? A little baggie in here, and you plug it up, and uh, you basically, it has holes in it, so it breathes, and you would breathe in, and breathe out through your nose, okay? So you would do that slowly so you don't hyperventilate for about five minutes, okay, once a day. If you have a real major situation, do it 20 minutes a day. You can break it up through the day, do it even more, but what happens, the ions from the sea salt, it's like going to the beach, all these incredible minerals go right into the lung, into the bloodstream, and they're antibacterial, anti-inflammatory, they support the adrenals. That's why people crave so much salt with adrenal, because when the adrenal's burnt out, you lose the salt that recharges the cell. So this recharges the body. This loosens mucus. That's why, like, even in the ocean, if you have something, it's like a natural disinfectant, you know, seawater. It just cleans everything. Uh, suppresses an overly sensitive immune system. So you might want to get one of these. They have real small ones, they have larger ones, and go ahead and do this if you have any of these symptoms right here. Put your comments below. Hey, you probably already subscribed, but if you haven't, press this little button down below and I will keep you updated.